Good morning, everybody. We continue to follow breaking news from the overnight hours of a teenager found shot and killed on Detroit's east side. We have been monitoring the investigation of this tragedy all morning long. Police continuing to try and piece together what happened and collect additional evidence. Lauren Pinnell's been on the scene there all morning and she joins us again now live. Lauren, anyone see the shooting happen? That's the thing right now. We are still waiting to learn about any particular witness information, Jason and Rhonda. I just got off the phone with Detroit police and as far as suspect information is concerned, we know that they're looking for two males in a black vehicle. It doesn't get more generic than that, so they are working with the family to try and get more specifics about who may have pulled the trigger. Now, let's show you a picture of this victim. The family is confirming for us this morning. 16 year old Terrell Martin Coleman was in fact shot here at this intersection at Roxbury and Casino on Detroit's east side. We're near Kelly and Meringue, and he was rushed to the hospital by his 25 year old brother who is here at the home. This is where this family lives on Roxbury, and the family tells us Terrell was outside with his younger brother, a 14 year old at the time of the shooting. Now take a look at some of the scene. Investigators arrived here on the city's east side around 3.30 this morning. The shooting happened around 1.30 because there was no EMS ambulance transfer. Detroit police went straight to the hospital to try and get whatever information they could from the family. Now we have yet been able to talk to that 25 year old brother who is simply devastated that he had to race his 16 year old brother to the hospital. So we haven't gotten that specific information yet from him about what he may have seen, but we did catch up with this young man's uh, uncle Bishop Willie Martin, who says his the entire family is devastated by this loss and this young man's life was taken far too soon. It's kind of hard, you know, you know, like I say is it's, it's, it's hard because, you know, you said if you is outside minding your own business and someone decides just to ride by and shoot, you know, that's that's just a coward way. So again, this still very much under investigation, and we're going to bring you the latest throughout the morning during the Today Show and, of course, at ClickOnDetroit.com. Reporting live from Detroit's east side, Lauren Podell, Local 4 News Today. All right, Lauren.